Hello everyone, we're going to show you how you can use the three scanning types, the three different trigger modes of the scanner. So the scanner has three trigger modes. It has manual trigger, which means that you need to press the button for the scanner to scan. It has continuous mode, which means that it remains in a scanning mode. You don't, you don't need to press the button, it just continuously scans everything that it detects. And then there's sense mode, which means that it's only scanning when it's detecting movement. Now, in order to do that, we just take the quick user mode, go quick user guide. I have my scanner connected to the computer via the USB dongle. So take the quick user guide. On the back of it, we have manual trigger, which is the default one. Second one is continuous mode and sense mode. To change over from manual trigger to continuous mode, I just scan continuous mode. I make sure that I cover sense mode so I don't scan it by accident. Scan it. And as you can see, I'm not pressing the button, but the light is on. So that means that it just automatically scans. You see, no button pressed, it just keeps on scanning. Yeah. If I want to change back to uh, normal mode, I just scan the normal mode. If I want to change to sense mode, just cover continuous mode, scan sense mode, and that's it. You see that it lights up as soon as it detects movement. So I stop moving it, as soon as I move it a bit, it turns on again. That's pretty much it. Change back to manual trigger, you see? I scan it in manual trigger, now I need to press the button. Otherwise I can move it, but it doesn't do anything until I press the button again and it works just fine. That's all. Thank you.